Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Tonight I'm going to be showing you how to install a Hudson float valve into your drum or to your tank. <clears throat> Super simple. Uh, get your Hudson float valve. It comes with a one inch male to a one inch male. So we just go ahead and screw that in. Uh, we're going to go back through and tape everything, but just for the sake of the video, this is how we're going to do it. So we'll take that and we're going to probably set ours <clears throat> about right here, right in there. Uh, so you get your hose saw. This is a two inch hose saw because this is a one inch uh, bulkhead. Good way to figure that out is take your hose saw, slide it up over and make sure it's not going to be bigger than, than your, uh, you're fitting so everything is good here um, get the drill so we're thinking <clears throat> that we want it about right here Should have tightened up the drill a little tighter, but got it cut out. Now this drum I got has a removable lid, which makes it super easy. So clean it out a little bit. Get that fuzz out of there. You don't want that stuff in your tank. You got to vacuum your tank out, clean it out. But just for the sake of the video, we'll take this slide this up through here we'll get our ring and we will slide our ring on and now that turns counterclockwise like such we're just going to hand tighten it take our Hudson float valve screw it on maybe There we go guys, that's how you install it. This kit, I got this kit from uh, Pressure Washer Products from Lori Smith, and it comes with this, which will go to your water hose, or you can switch it out for a one inch hose barb to three, or one inch male to a uh, three quarter hose barb. And that's it. That's how you install a Hudson float valve. 